Hi guys, Bash here. So today I'm at uh, the Columbia River, Bolivar Dam, targeting for shad. The month of June is the month of shad fishing. A lot of fun. Uh, I was supposed to be here one week ago, but uh, I was seriously sick. So that's why I came here today, being a week later than I was supposed to be here. Um, uh, now it's just the start of the season. Not many people are here. Like in the second and third week of June, you will see like hundreds of people are here. Yeah, let's just uh, before I jump into the fishing, I will try to answer uh, a question of a lot of people asking me. Like when you are using shutter that, uh, there is two weeks, right? So are uh, like uh, let's see. This is a small uh, shut up and a big shut up. Like uh, a lot of people have asked me what to use at which condition. So here's my understanding. The smaller ones, they get a better chance of bite. The fish always prefer to bite it on small ones. But as you can see, the hook is quite small. So if you land it on a big shad, um, the possibility of the lose the fish with a small hook is higher. So in short, if you want more bite, use a small one. If you want to land more and you don't uh, want to lose a lot of fish, use a big one. So that's my understanding uh, of uh, the light one and the heavy one of the shut dot. Okay, so that's it. Let's uh, kick off and get it started. Here's my setup. As always, I'm using my line 6 medium light fishing rod, 3000 reel, 15 pound main line. And over there, I'm using a X-Sync, the uh, half ounce X-Sync with a 12 pound lead line. Uh, that is one of eight ounce shad that green color uh, I'm using right now. So let's cast out and see our luck today. So as you can see, now in the river, the current is strong. That's why I cast it out, wait about like uh, 5 to 10 seconds before I reel in. Um, pay attention to the reeling speed I'm using. That's the speed which triggers the shad uh, bite. Ideally, you always want to cut the uh, line tight enough to feel the bite, but not quick, too quick. Um, so it's just like quick enough to be tight to feel the bang 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 of the uh, fish bite. Let's see it again. Cast it out and wait for a few seconds. Uh, that 5 to 10 seconds depends on how strong the current is. You want your jig sink to the bottom of the river because that's most shad uh, will be at the bottom of the river and then you reel at the right speed to keep the line tight. And the shad that is very light, fish on. The shad uh, bite is very very light. You kind of just feel like a nipple of it, and that at that time you set the hook right away. Yeah, this is feel like the really good fish. Come on, come on, come on, come on! Don't break off. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Yes, yes, that's that's a really beautiful fish. Yeah, I'm excited. I've been waiting for this kind of action for a whole year. Nice. So sometimes there will be low current because the dam doesn't release water. At this time, the technique were a little bit different. You cast it out, but you don't wait it sink to the bottom. You just like cast it out and you reel in immediately because if there is no current, you wait will be sink to the bottom quite quick. You just like cast it out, don't wait, and just reel in like uh, back directly. So that is just how I do it when there is no current, which is quite efficient for me. Um, this technique when the current is not strong enough to for drift fishing. So if you guys have the chance when you see this low current, just try this way. I promise this will work. Yes, yes. You see, I get this fish. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yeah, this feels like another good one. Yeah, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Yeah, come on, come on, come on, come
20. Number 20. Fifty-five. Okay, number sixty. So this is my number sixty for today, and I'm going to stop my recording and now um, fish about like five hours. Get sixty fish, not bad at all. Consider now it's just a start of the season. Seems like this will be a better year compared with last year, and uh, yeah, that's will be much it for today's video hope you guys like it and see you guys next time bye bye